what's up guys this is pastor canada again we're coming out with another video another tutorial really quick in c sharp and today we're going to be uh this is how we can add a library into your uh project okay and you right now have a console application console app you know this is this is nothing related <laughs> this is just some code that i was playing around before so let's go to our folder so the name of the library is called uh, connect Right here, what we're going to be needed from here, it is that connect CS that CS project. Okay, so let's close that. Okay, let's add it. So in order to add it, we gotta go to our solution name. We gotta do a right click. We go add, and then we go existing project. And then should open that. It will go straight to the folder. And then you uh, select the connect that CS project, and then you go to open. And then that should be popping up in your solution right here. As you can tell, connect this right there. But now that's not it. So now, now the next step is we got to add um, the reference into that ref, reference of that project or that library into our uh, project, the console application. So how we do that, we do a right click on the console app one. And then we go to add. And then we do a project reference. And right here, we're going to check mark. This is going to be under project and solutions. Check mark that. Just go OK. And that should be ready to go. And then we go to program CS um, for our yeah uh, console application. And right here, let's see if we can use that. Let's uh, do connect. The, the name of the this class is called connectivity. Connectivity. So let me show you really quick before we do that. So what do we have in this class in that library? So let's see. So right here, we just have a property. So the name of this class is called connectivity. And then we have just a property, a public property by the name on connect. And then I have a constructor. So basically it's doing nothing. <laughs> they just put some random stuff right there. So we can see this works. Okay, cool. So we're going to need this name right here, name of the class. So let's go back to our program CS, connectivity, and then we're given a name. Let's just do connect, uh, semicolon. Now it's giving the squirrely, the red squirrely, what is it, show potentials, and then using connect. So we got to use that in here. So it is right there. We just, we're doing that. And now we can just do, so what we need is that the uh, property name right here by the name uh, on connect okay let's see if we can find it let's go back to our program cs let's just do connect uh, let's just look for on connect oh it's going to be that on connect right there yeah there's not too much implementation in this library that's why it's going to give you the the red squirrely you know but the main thing is like you know it was able just to see it you know, recognize it, right, on connect. So that's working. So our library, our reference uh, is working pretty good. So that was the whole purpose of the video. And uh, maybe later we can just keep on doing more videos about this and how we can use actually a li uh, pretty well done library that we can use it for different projects. But anyway, so have a, have a good day. I will see you in the next video. Okay, bye.